was going to say that the real trick about when you're trying to change things is to get really so solid on what it is you're trying to achieve. In my case, I'm trying to stop, and well, I have stopped smoking. And um, so I've got to balance everything else in my life around that now. Uh, I'm finding I need a lot more sleep. Um, because of this and the other thing is if you're sleeping you're not smoking so that's a good thing you know you're not having any of those triggers or anything um, I'm off the patch now so I know that that's made a difference as well so lots of little things are coming in so whatever your issue is that you're dealing with um, get really clear with it understand that the one doesn't mean it's you know you've got to stop doing the other I'm just trying to keep mine in balance I'm going to try not to put on 20 pounds which is what I normally do when I quit um, but on the other hand if that's the price I have to pay then so be it makes sense uh, but the interesting thing is for those of you who are interested in what's happening to me as a person is that I actually am feeling very good if I ignore the weight issue. Uh, I'm feeling very good in myself. I'd love to tell you that I'm feeling highly energized. I feel good. Um, I feel a lot better than I did a week ago. Um, I don't feel fuzzy anymore, and maybe that's because they're not pumping nicotine into me anymore because I've stopped the patch. Um, so I'm beginning to feel clear in that perspective. So um, it's been actually fairly good quitting this time um, when I say fairly good um, although the first week was difficult and of course it's difficult you know you, you've got a terrible addiction that you're trying to stop um, I, I actually am quite I feel very um, empowered I think is the word and I want to thank every one of you who has supported me in this because boy you might not think it makes a difference but it surely does because every time um, you guys you know do the support thing I'm sitting here and I'm going oh it's good because people care and <laughs> Please remember to give your age, sex and country if you're asking questions, just so that I can make it appropriate in the reply. And also, if I haven't replied to your question, really sorry, the chances are I've missed it somehow. Please send it again. For those of you who want to find out what I'm doing in my day-to-day -day life, please go to dearmamasal.blogspot.ca and read about what I'm doing there. Um, if you've enjoyed the video, please share it with people because we're aiming here just to help more and more people. And if you're new to the channel and have enjoyed the video, please thank the person who sent you here. My big hugs as usual, and many, many thanks. This is Mama Sal saying bye for now.